وما خلقنا السماوات والأرض وما بينهما إلا بالحق وإن الساعة لآتية فاصفح الصفح الجميل إن ربك هو الخلاق العليم Hello and welcome to my channel. My name is Shafiq. In this video, I will be giving you a very interesting story you need to know regarding the keys to the door of the Holy Kaaba. I will also be telling you some facts about the Holy Kaaba that you really need to know. If you are new to my channel, kindly subscribe. If you are a returning subscriber, I thank you very much and let's get into the very interesting story. Although Masjid al-Haram and the Holy Kaaba are being managed by the Saudi government, the keys of the Holy Kaaba are with the Al-Shaiba tribe. The keys of the Kaaba might seem normal, but the story behind it is really moving and will keep your Iman enlightened after you hear the story. The keys of Kaaba have been kept with the Shaibi family for over a century now. The major question will be how come Saudi government does not have the keys? So, the answer to these questions is that Allah had already chosen the key bearer of the Holy Kaaba many years ago. In the eighth year of Hijrah, when Islam won over Mecca, and then our beloved Prophet, peace be upon him, wanted to enter the Kaaba, but the door was locked. The public saw it and suggested to the Prophet that the keys were with Uthman bin Ibn Talha, who was hiding on top of the Kaaba. Prophet, peace be upon him, then commanded Ali ibn Abi Talib to grab the keys from Uthman ibn Talha and open the Kaaba gate. When Ali radiallahu anhu demanded keys from Uthman ibn Talha, he refused to hand them over to him. However, Ali radiallahu anhu snatched the keys from him and he denied handing them over. Then Ali radiallahu anhu opened the gate of the Holy Kaaba. The Prophet, peace be upon him, entered and was offering the salam. At that time, Jibril alayhi salam came with the revelation of the Holy Quran. The verses were, إن الله يأمركم أن تؤدوا الأمانات إلى أهلها وإذا حكمتم بين الناس أن تحكموا بالعدل إن الله نعم ما يعذكم به إن الله كان سميعا بصيرا meaning indeed Allah commands you to render trusts to whom they are due and when you judge between people to judge with justice Excellent is that which Allah instructs you. Indeed, Allah is ever hearing and seeing. As soon as Prophet, peace be upon him, heard these verses of the Holy Quran, he commanded Ali, peace be upon him, to, he commanded Ali, radiallahu anhu, to give the keys back to Uthman ibn Talha and apologize for the misbehavior. Uthman ibn Talha was shocked to see when Ali radiallahu anhu turned the keys after Prophet peace be upon him's command. He cannot believe the fact that the Prophet 
who has conquered the Mecca is returning keys to him later. Later, Ali radiallahu anhu explained that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala wanted Uthman ibn Talha to have the keys of Kaaba. At that time, Uthman ibn Talha recited, Uthman accepted Islam. As soon as he accepted Islam, Jibril came once again with a message from Allah that the keys of Kaaba will remain with the family of Uthman ibn Talha until the day of judgment. Later, Uthman ibn Talha became one of the greatest companions of the Prophet, peace be upon him, and a great Muslim. This story is indeed an astonishing thing to know as a Muslim. Even today, the keys are with the family of Uthman ibn Talha. Until date, his family the Saudi government only manages the, the haram and their Kaaba, but the protection of the keys is in the family of Al Shaiba. Some facts you did not know about the Kaaba are. The Kaaba was constructed several times. It was built by Prophet Ibrahim and Ismail, but it does not look the same as it went through a major construction during the Prophet's era. The last biggest construction took place in 1996, which replaced many stones and made the foundation even stronger. Kaaba's two doors and a window the Kaaba had two doors, one for entering and the other one for exiting, but now it only has one door and one window. It used to be malt colored. Kaaba was never black clothed. The tradition of black clothing was started by Abbasids, whose household favorite color was black. The keys of the Kaaba are held by the Al Shaiba family. Kaaba used to be open for everyone back in the day, but it is now under restriction. You could swim to into Mecca because the drainage system by then wasn't good, but it is now better. Because the Kaaba is in a valley, so you would have to swim. The black stone is broken, that is why it is closed. Also, while you are inside the Kaaba, you can pray in any direction. Door opening, it, the door for the Kaaba only opens twice a year. Those are some of the facts about the Kaaba you may not know. Subscribe to our channel if you are new so you do not miss out more of such interesting stories.